guys, it's Thrift Mess Videos Day 2. Now, I'm doing the haul for the Thrift With Me. Um, we're still in our little setup where I'm just using my phone because it's just working out. So it's like a little DIY Thrift Mess. But I got some good stuff. Let's try them on and see what they look like. Hi guys, welcome back to Model Image. If this is your first time, hi, my name is Rishi. I'm a lover of fashion, the business of fashion. I'm also a little obsessed with vintage. If this is your first time, I do a lot of styling content here, primarily through thrifted or vintage finds. So if you do like styling content, please consider subscribing. I'd love for you to join the family. So I did the Come Thrift With Me for Monday's video. Now with the time getting dark by the time we hit 3.30, I think it's gonna be definitely better for me to do the hauls on separate days for most of the thrift with me's and that's good because I'm doing three videos a week so there's a little room to do that and you won't have to wait too long for the haul so I'll just get right into it again just as a reminder I set a $25 challenge because I don't want to have a hundred pieces of thrifted items in this quick in this little thrift mass series so so far I got three Pajamas is always on the Christmas shopping list and luckily I found two. I also found two cotton ones So it'll be nice and cozy because it's nice and warm in my apartment. So I don't need anything too thick um, Any wool or anything um, That's gonna make me extremely hot in the night. So I was very happy to find these now, you know Victoria's Secrets they run from 40 to $70 for uh, their set of pajamas So I was happy that I was able to find these and I have these two sets. Now, this is actually an extra small, and this is a medium. Normally, I set up to a, size up to a medium for my pajamas because I want it nice and loose and comfy. But when I picked them both up, this didn't look that much smaller um, when I picked this up, and this was the first one I picked up. So I think it'll be okay. I'll try these on, as well as the fabulous 1980s jacket. And as much as this the construction of this gorgeous 80s bomber jacket the, the thing is it's gonna be nice and thick here but here is really thin and i'm like where i don't know how i'd wear it i just have to make sure i get some heat tech and that will counteract or you know just if i'm gonna just spend most of the time indoor this should be okay anyway but i had to get this this is just too gorgeous um, one-of-a-kind type 80s piece that these are the reasons I go out thrifting I'm looking for these fabulous unique just treasures from the past <laughs> so I will style this up for you as well it's not often that I do a pajama try on on this channel but <laughs> we're hauling so here is the first of the pajama sets um, this is the extra small, you know, the closest you could see is probably on the thighs, but it's it's okay It's perfectly fine. The length on the feet are great. I just put it on with some Birkenstocks keeping it pajama style um, But yeah, it fits really well sleeve length is fine um, It just feels it's just a really soft cotton. It does have like strings here to tighten it, but the waist is perfect I it is such a perfect find for pajamas so i can check that off my list it's always i was already on amazon trying to figure out um what pajamas i'm gonna buy so yeah pajama number one pajama number two now you can see that this is a lot more relaxed a lot more loose this is the medium which you know there's no big distinction in the arms so it's not gonna you know affect anything still nice uh, probably a little longer in the length but it's still really nice just relax also pocket in this one again for the little tie here i did use a i did um gather this a little more so it works it's not just for because some of these are for show but it actually works and it's fitting nice and snug on the hips so yeah pajama num that's what i love with thrifting when i started thrifting i was looking for vintage stuff i got hooked on it from my grandma giving me her stuff and i love them and you know i just went thrifting because i wanted to find more vintage goals but a day like today where you never know what you're gonna find i the last thing on my mind was that i was gonna find two sets of perfect pajamas victoria's secret 
I just saved 40 to 70 dollars <laughs> per set. That is what I love. And I did find um, a broken like new tag on this one. Um, so I, from I saw the, the tags, I knew they were like brand new, um, donated. So I, I just love this. Check, 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 check off my list. This is perfect. And they're so, so soft. It does have like a little, um, VS logo here. Feeling nice and chic. Feeling so chic for the holidays. Love this. So hair is that beautiful, it is bummer. Now, because this is such a statement, I just went nice black um, bottoms with this. If I had a black dress, I would have just thrown on a nice little bodycon black dress with this and let this do the talking. I don't have that black dress, but what I do have is my staple uh, pencil maxi skirt, which I love. And I just threw on a turtleneck um, on top and just let this, you know, this is a statement in, in itself, and it's just a simple, easy um, outfit. You know, not everything has to be complicated. It's just dress and a jacket or a top and a skirt, and that's it. I absolutely just love this. If I was going for more drama, I'd definitely do a nice maxi um, surface skirt. I think that would up it even more if I wanted something a little more formal from this look but something just casual cozy laid back and for a very festive season um, I think this is perfect so just to give you a little more close-up of what it looks like it's like this champagne and pink fabric in here some studs on the um, on the suede and it's real suede and I, I just, it's just so amazing. Then you have this, this little block of gold. It is just ages <laughs> in a bummer. Like, how do you say no to this? How do you say no to this? This is just so, so perfect. Love, love, love it. This is what the back looks like. It is so stunning. Um, I tend to like with this hair pushing it back and keeping it out of my face but if I'm going somewhere special then I definitely put the bang back so I thought because this is more of a you know chic night out look I thought I'd put the hair back <laughs> the problem with this hair is I can't wear a hat so I'm probably gonna have to switch this hair up pretty soon but I'm enjoying the red splash of red for now it's special with brown um, I should have shown you my birthday look did I did I upload that I'll try to get that up um, but yeah so this is the look oh I didn't add a bag to this and for bag I think this little gold chain um, chain link like vintage bag I'm doing more vintage and it works perfectly for this outfit I just love the little gold um, it does hold my phone and keys and all the necessary things so this is a fun go-to for me and if I wanted something a little more casual then I'd go in this case this bag would become a little more casual with the gold going on and this would carry it back a little more um, and this is a Teddy Blake um, Kim bag in blazer that I just absolutely love so if I want to take a little bit more then I just grab this one um, but yeah just I'm just loving this black jacket I'm it still worked in my budget, so <laughs> it's definitely possible to get awesome pieces on my budget. So I can't wait to see what else I will find. So yeah, that is the last thing that I got and I just love it. <laughs> so guys, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to let me know in the comment section which of my thrifted pieces were your favorite. Don't forget to subscribe. I'd love for you to join the family. And if you did like this video, please give it a like. And I'll see you guys in the next one.